Do you feel like your ankle is constantly giving out? Did you go to many doctors who all said the same thing? You need surgery to fix the problem? What if I told you that you may not need surgery to improve this condition? Well, discover prolotherapy, a game changer for a stable and pain-free ankle. In this video, learn how prolotherapy offers a safe and natural alternative bringing hope for lasting relief. Say goodbye to surgery worries and bring in the pain-free future with prolotherapy. Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kim, America's holistic foot doctor. If you're tired of living with chronic ankle instability but are afraid of invasive surgery, you're in the right place. Today, we're diving into the world of prolotherapy, a revolutionary treatment that could change how you manage your ankle pain and instability. Join me as we explore how prolotherapy offers a safe and natural alternative to surgery, offering hope for a pain-free future. Stay tuned to the end where I show you a live procedure with a patient and a testimonial of a happy patient after prolotherapy. Let's get right into the video. Well, let's talk about dextrose or sugar. This is called prolotherapy. And this history is Dr. Earl Gatney in 1936. Uh, he had a career ending thumb injury. He was a general surgeon at Philadelphia Hospital and out of all places, he was operating, he was coming out of the uh, OR operating room and he jammed his thumb uh, under the door and he damaged the big uh, toe, I mean big, um, your thumb. And then he had instability where he could not operate anymore. He was not effective, he wasn't doing as good of a job. So he went to all this, his colleagues and his uh, uh, other doctors and they said, you need to change your career because you cannot operate anymore because of this injury. So he happened to go to this uh, lecture called hernia sclerotherapy at the time by these other general surgeons. And as he was uh, listening to these people, and these, these are the general surgeons that without doing surgery, when somebody has hernia, they use this sclerosing agent or irritating agent, just like sugar. And then they put it into the uh, hernia area. As you know, hernia is the opening of the stomach wall where intestines coming through, right? So instead of using the surgery, they would inject this uh, irritating solution and lo and behold, it tightens up that whole muscle and your, your fascia area to completely cure this area without the surgery. So he got that idea, obviously, he started experimenting on his own thumb, then lo and behold, he regained his stability, his strength, so he was able to go back uh, being the general surgeon that he was, and then he started uh, learning about other joints, your knees and the backs, and he started using that to uh, strengthen the ligament where it strengthens the joint, where it re revived a lot of the joint uh, and wrote a lot of papers on this. So that's how he became famous for his uh, prolotherapy. Dr. George Hackett, uh, he took from Dr. Gadney and then he started uh, questioning as to what else can we do with this. And one day he realized that uh, when when they uh, did a hernia, this hernia surgery, uh, hernia injections with the uh, irritating uh, agents, when this irritating solution leaked into this other area of the spine, he realized that it actually strengthened the uh, spine and then made the joint work a lot better. So that's when he got this idea of utilizing, by accident, <laughs> you're utilizing a lot of spinal ligaments on your back. You start injecting this uh, dextrose or, or irritating solution and it strengthened your back and also eliminated a lot of the back problem. So he coined this term prolotherapy from the proliferative, proliferative therapy, uh, short prolotherapy in the 1950s and that's why this prolotherapy is uh, started with Dr. Hackett in the 1950s. So this is sugar is irritant to irritate and causes inflammation. And when it comes down, it tightens the area and makes things more stable. And then it causes proliferation we talk about. And this rebuilds and regenerates all the tissues. It increases fibroblasts. Fibroblasts is a cell that increases your connective tissue regeneration is a fibroblast. And it tightens uh, torn and loose ligaments. And as you can see, I use it on the uh, ankle when people come in with the unstable ankle from multiple uh, previous sprains and never got better. 
un was never immobilized properly and never treated properly. And then when they come see me, it's loose and it requires uh, regenerating of the ligaments. When I inject it into the area, it tightens up really, really well, become very stable. You can also use it for the big toe when you have a bunion, where the joint is shifted in one direction. You can use it on these other areas to tighten up the ligament. That makes the, the joint moves better and work better. So it eliminates the pain in this area as well. Any other uh, sprain and any, any other injuries also it, it injures their ligament which is holding all the bones together so when it loosens up it start damaging the joint so when you inject around the joint area it tightens all the ligaments around the joint makes the joint work a lot better so we're uh, doing what we call a prolotherapy which means uh, we're trying to reconnect or tighten up the ligament that's damaged it's been sprained so it's stretched out so uh, this spot in the middle is the area of the uh, ligament damage. So we're going to use the prolotherapy medication, um, sugar or saline uh, mixed with um, calcium gluconate and um, some anesthesia. I'm going to put it all over this area to tighten up this area, followed by the ozone that I just made, which is what's going to help this. Unfortunately, this science has been around for over 70 years with Dr. Uh, Dr. Hackett in 1950, but uh, unfortunately, uh, very few doctors are actually using this uh, instead of uh, doing surgery because surgery is uh, takes a long time to heal but um, unfortunately this works very well to tighten up this ligament uh, instead of doing surgery so here's the prototherapy treatment uh, so i want to tighten up all the other ligaments not only the ligament that is damaged but all the other surrounding ligaments so i, I put them all over the place this is already numb so patient is pretty comfortable at this time so i put it right into the deeper area of where the ligaments are and I come out and I go deeper into it. And I do deeper into it. So this tightens up all the ligaments underneath it because when you injured this um, ankle, all the other areas of the ligaments are damaged at the same time. So we wanna make sure that we hit all the other area at the same time. So very important to get all the other ligaments all at the same time. And it works very well, it prevents surgery, so it's, it's an amazing thing to do. Also, I follow this with the ozone, which is, it's a gas, ozone gas, um, into it. So it activates all the ingredients that I put in there. Uh, it works really well as well. So I use ozone gas right into it. I don't have to, I, I can just go to one spot and just kind of put it all over the place so that all the ingredients that I put in there would be activated and works very effectively, so. So this is my second time coming back for a second session of phototherapy, uh, working on this ligament. And after the first one, it's been two weeks. It feels tighter, stronger. Um, looking forward to the second one. And I've also had a tendon fixed with Dr. Kim and gone through the whole process before. And it was fantastic. And I was in a lot of pain, couldn't walk, it was stiff. We went through the process and um, about a couple of days after I got done not walking on it for a, uh, two weeks, like Dr. Kim told me, I actually went to Disneyland. <laughs> Against my so, advice. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But you, you did fine. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's very good. Yes. Thank you. Kim. Thank you for watching my video about prolotherapy. As you can see in this video, prolotherapy is a powerful tool to preventing surgery for chronic ankle sprains. If you live near my office in Long Beach, California, you can come see me as a patient. But if you live far away, you should find a local doctor who can perform this procedure. Until then, be educated, get empowered, encourage others today.